Yo, what's up? This is your boy AG coming back with another quick tutorial for you um, for Machine Masters. On this one, I'm going to show you how to import your own drums. Alright, so right now, you know, we got all the, the machine uh, drums and sounds. This one is on the projects. So if you scroll through, all of this is machine stuff. You can see all the tags and everything. Alright, how you get to yours is you want to click this little um, person icon right here. Click that alright now this is all I have in here right now I still I'm still working on setting my um my sounds up so this is a perfect time for me to tell the newbies how to do it alright so first thing you want to do is go up here to files so now you in library go to files alright these are my two hard drives I got set up so far you wanna double click and open up your hard drive or wherever you got your drums at uh, right here I'm gonna uh, import this folder right here AG got drums so you can either uh, right click on it and go to import library or you can go down here and click import library alright so now your types and your modes is coming up which is like for you to tag them to tell machine uh, what tags to use for them so when you're looking for them you can find them easily so I'm just gonna go ahead and click drums alright and pretty much it's all different kinds of drums right now so I'm just gonna import the whole folder and then I'll go in and and uh, tidy it up later on so you wanna click OK and right now it's scanning and it's uh, putting all the drums in, into the database for machine and it's gonna give them tags. This may take a minute so I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video right, and I'll so come so back when it's done. Importing. So I uh, now um, if we come let me go to library right now since we already have the user selected you can see all of the drum kits well these are the samples you can see all the samples that's that has been imported from my drum folder alright now say for instance if I wanted to load this Paul Nice one right here up so I can just either drag drop it over I can double click it or I can click on this button right here which is the auto load so what that means is any sound or any drum loop kick snare whatever I click on is gonna automatically load to the sound that I have selected so I'm just gonna go ahead and click that alright and y'all should know about the shift mute from uh, 1.8 so um, if anything is playing and you want it to stop just hit shift mute and uh, it'll stop playing alright so I showed y'all how to load it from off the software now we can go to the hardware and load it off the hardware by clicking browse alright now we have the sample select I mean we have the the sample user screen up right now so now we could go ahead and scroll over using this this knob right here alright I'm gonna go ahead and select my AG guy drums um, for some reason well I guess I don't have an image anyway but nothing comes up for the users but um, you can see battery platinum bounce and there's still some other expansions that I gotta import but for now I'm gonna go ahead and go to the AG guy drums so you can see it over here on this screen right here and as I scroll down you can hear it I got it on pre here so you can scroll down and listen to them so let's say I wanted to load that one but I don't want it on this pad go ahead and I gotta come out of there first out of browse click this pad select it then hit browse again alright now I can load it shift mute so now I got Now I got and you can just continue to load your sounds up build your kit how you want to build it um, but that's just the basics I hope this helps somebody out other than that I catch y'all on the next video make sure y'all visit machinemasters.com for more free tutorials uh, sample pack Saturday 
beat battles, giveaways, some of everything, man. I'll holler at y'all in the next one. Peace.